Wait one second, making sure I'm recording. I should be recording now. Okay. Hello and welcome back to Minecraft Jung Paradise Golden Age, episode 5, 600, 631, part 2. Oh, okay. Oh, that's a nice shot right there. Sorry about that. I like to take screenshots sometimes. Okay. But hopefully you are all doing okay today and seeing safe. This is part 2 of last episode of working on the museum. We have been busy at work, carving away at this wall because we need to make all of this connect up with each other it's not as big as i would want it to be the mountain is really limited and you know how wide it goes so our best uh way that we can actually work with this mountain next would probably be to dig under the mountain where it's more thicker so we have also new a new plan of uh digging down here one day I don't think we'll do it anytime soon, because I have too many other stuff that I need to work on. Like going to the end and gathering up sand for a uh, concrete or for making glass. Eh, we'll see. Now, so I do actually need to go collect some sand soon. So maybe next episode I might go and gather up some sand for making glass and then using that glass for uh Making kind of an office over in that area. I want to try and make like an office. I think that's what I'll do. I'll make it like an office coming out this way. So where these two blocks are, I'll make it, you know, curve outwards over here. Yeah, kind of just a tiny office office area. Yeah, as that I'll probably use it for. Dinosaur fossils and structures. Ah, uh, let's see. I do find it quite sad that, you know, this is how far we can actually extend. I actually have to test the dirt every once in a while to see if it's thick enough for us to, you know, do up the roof soon. Because we need to do up the roof after we're done with this. Ah, uh, let's see. I don't know what I'll do the roof up. I think I might just copy this one. Just make it all stone bricks. Uh, let's see. Or maybe that I'll probably, you know, put wood up there and then do like a wood cross patch work. Fell down a hole there. Okay, breaking all of this. I'll put that back a second because I want to grab some oak. And this oak shall come in handy because I want to fill up this hole. Sorry, Melanie. There we go. No, Melanie! I wanted you to stay up there, not come down here. Okay, there we go. No! Melanie, please! I need to work. I tell you, Melanie gets in the way of working. Either that, they keep drowning, drowning themselves. There we go. Melanie, please, okay. They're actually listening to me and not going in the hole. There we go. Well, that's just a little bit of the slower work done while we're working on this place. Just so I don't fall down while I'm mining and then accidentally hit something else that I'm not supposed to. Uh, happened so many times before. And I accidentally just kept on mining in the wrong area. Yeah, there we go. Break all of this. And that should work out very nicely. There we go. Ah, uh, this is... It's been quite rough all of this uh, mining... Of all this uh, blocks recently. Uh, I'm going to rest a second. And we might as well talk about like future ideas for the museum. Uh, I will fill all of that up. And then I shall put a temporary torch. I hear a skeleton somewhere. 
I think it's more off in that direction or that direction. I think it's night time outside. Let's me go check if it's night time. Nope, it's morning. Don't know where it's coming from then. Okay. Oh, okay. So, as I rest my arm for a second to talk about some future ideas for the museum. Now, I want to maybe make an office over here. I think that's what I might do. But I'll probably make it a little bit smaller. I don't think I want to make it too big. I'll probably move that coal block over there just a few more blocks down. Just so it's a little bit smaller and not too, you know, taking up a lot of the walking area. And then, we'll probably expand down that other way, right? Down that tunnel. I'll probably make a nice staircase going down. And then it'll be a whole, you know, complex to itself, right? Whole new area for uh, our dinosaur area. Well, dinosaur museum. Museum. Mostly just museum. I do have a basic idea, right? I guess I could take a few ideas from a, another build project. Hmm. You know what? I cannot actually remember the build project's name. I'm pretty sure I called it the Great Spinny Top. Something like that. But it is like a museum kind of thing. Well, like a museum. It's more like a grand structure that I was supposed to build in a... Uh, maybe Voxtown or maybe... Yeah, I think I might build it in Voxtown. Hmm. Either that maybe over here? Like a big grand structure. It'd be quite big. So that's a big problem. Also, I never realised how many lakes are around here. I should start patching up a lot of these lakes. I don't really think too many of them are needed. Look how many are scattered throughout this one area. That's a lot of lakes. Oh, ponds. Yeah, ponds. Uh, let's see. Well, as I gave my arm a bit of a rest, I might as well get back to work. Breaking all of this away. Can't wait for uh, actually finishing the uh, place, this place. I'll probably do a quick, you know, do up of the walls. And then, probably do a little bit of slowing, and then that should be us done with this episode. Uh, let's see. It'll take me quite a little while to do up all the walls around here. The roof can wait for another time. I'm not very... I'm not very a uh, roof person. You know, doing up roofs. Roofs. With uh, nice designs. I think the nicest roof designs that I've done, maybe... In my own house, maybe even the, the sheep farm that you can see on the map, up there on the right. It's all the way down, but you can see the rainbow roof of the sheep farm. Maybe we might work on that. Well, not work on that. Maybe we might copy like some design ideas for like roofs from other builds that we've already done so far. And also, it seems like I am now full. Once again, I'm full on inventory space. There we go. That is so much stone. I tell you, that is so much stone. Uh, place the crafting table there. Quite nice. Quite nice. Sorry, I was just admiring my work there. Uh, I think once it's all done, it'll look a lot nicer. And once we have exhibits... I think I might put, uh, I did want to put some ancient armors in the museum. Like some old school armors that we have laying around. I do have my original set of iron armor, but sadly, I remember the episode that I fell and died in the nether. I think that's what happened. I think it was I fell and died. I fall and die in the nether quite a lot back in the day. Like, I gave up my Pixelmon original series because I died in the nether. And it was so bad because I just went and gathered up so much glowstone. It took me, like, so long. And then I just end up falling down a hole. Oh, I was so sad that time. Oh. 
you know, I just went through all of that work. You know, I was so happy. I had the glowstone. I was ready for, you know, continuing. And I fall down one of the stupid 1.7.10 holes in the nether. Uh, and then I just die. Instantly. Did not even give me a second to react. Died. Instantly. Uh... Maybe I should put a pillar somewhere around here. Maybe that would be cool. I sort of idea of extending the roof upwards there. Like kind of like a staircase like that. Hmm. I like the idea, but I'd probably put it somewhere over there if it did do that. You know what, that's not too bad of an idea. I need to remind myself to uh, do that. Do a like a spinny staircase upwards. I think that'd work out pretty good. I, I really remember, I remember going down one of those. I really hate how it goes so narrow when, you know, on the other side. I think it was like uh, Edinburgh, the capital of Scotland, if you did not know. Edinburgh. But uh, there was a museum, there's a museum there that I went to see a long time ago now. Uh, let's see. But I remember the top staircase was so scary. Like it goes in so narrow on that staircase that oh. Still send shivers down how narrow it felt. Probably just seems like a normal staircase to most people. But you know, when someone else is coming up these stairs on the other side, oh, it can get really tight. Get out of the hole. Also, I'm doing up the floor. I can't. I did not. I just instantly just went and did that while I was doing work. There we go. Put that there. Mine out some more of this. That's not too bad. That's not too bad at all. You know what? I just got a good balcony design area idea. So I so thought something like that for a balcony. Hmm. Probably like, you know, chopping this bit right here and then along. I feel like that would be a good balcony. I have an idea for balconies. But the thing is, I don't really get to build many balconies in my world. I think the only balcony that really exists right now is the one in my house. That's the only balcony. So I might as well, you know, do that for uh, something soon. Do another balcony. Uh, it would be good to do a balcony. It's not every day that I get to do a balcony, so I might do a balcony. I'll do a balcony. But I'll probably leave it for the future. Spinny stair kiss. And dig tunnel down. In muzi museum. There we go. Fill all of that in. Oh, you got out of that hole finally. Okay. Well, that should work, you know, for uh, reminding me. I'll pop it up at the end of the episode. So, to keep me in mind to do that, as that when I rewatch it. Uh, let's see. I was planning on a uh, recording after this. I was going to the n end to go do that end adventure, but I need to rest my arm. You know when your arm gets a bit too ache from uh, playing too long. It's kind of that. So I'll take a break after this for a little while, then get back to recording. I need to go record some Bioshock. Hmm, maybe some VTuber Connect, Stardew Valley. 
maybe something else. Uh, let's see. I'm looking fo forward to uh, finishing Bioshock 2 and then heading. Well, not heading. Doing after that a Far Cry 2 and a Fallout New Vegas series. Again, it's been like one year since I last did a Fallout New Vegas series in the original playlist. The original playlist, that's why I would count as, you know, how long ago. Because when that playlist ended, that was the end of our adventure in Fallout New Vegas. We did do a few episodes after that, but you know, I don't count those, you know, real. I did cheat on those because uh, I wanted to, you know, get into the action and actually play the game instead of, you know, the slow progression. But then, you know, the slow prog progression is, you know, the fun part about Fallout New Vegas. Trying to get your speech high enough for uh, that skill check. Uh, let's see. So we'll probably do a special one. And then once I probably do uh, that, when I finish doing uh, Fallout New Vegas, or I take a break from it, I'll probably do Skyrim. But after I finish uh, Bioshock 2, I'm definitely doing Far Cry 3. And then another Brother in Arms game. Uh, let's see. Looking forward to doing another Brother in Arms game. Next is Brother in Arms Earned in Blood, and then after that, one that I'm not really looking too forward to no more. I looked forward to it back in the day. I actually had it for the PS3, but I never got around to playing it. And that was Brother in Arms Hell's Highway. The one that I never played back in the day. I might have played it, I don't know. But I don't remember playing it, so. I remember checking it out a long time ago and it starts off in like a burning building, I think. Something like that. It's been that long that I can't not remember. But I'm looking forward to going back there. I did find out that you still play as Baker. I don't know why. I feel like they could have done a new character. I know Baker's kind of established already, but I feel like, you know, you could have did a new character, a new commanding officer, a new person to take command of a unit, and, you know, they could have done the Battle of the Bulge, oh, that would have been cool. Commanding soldiers in the Battle of the Bulge. I feel like if they did, like, the wintery bit of, like, you know, I know it's kind of not really a good part of that game, but the wintery bit of, like, you know, Call of Duty World War Two. That was a terrible game. I remember playing through it. Uh, there we go. But I think uh, the wintery bit in that would probably be a nice idea for like a next Brothers in Arms game. It's not really the best bit in the game, but you know, I did enjoy like the snow. So probably like that. Uh, let's see. It's just an idea. But I feel like a Brothers in Arms based in the Battle of the Bulge would be pretty cool. And then entering more into Germany, you know, with all the civilians, you know, fleeing towards you. Because the Germans sent a bunch of civilians towards them. Uh, let's see. There we go. bad. I need to go grab some more wood now. I'm telling you, I'm using up quite a lot of the oak that I was going to use for another build project, that being a clock tower for Mass Halden. I need to get that done for 6.50. And I'll see. I think that's what we'll do. We'll try and get as much done before episode 650 so we can show it off in the world tour. I'm pretty sure the world, uh, world, the, the 550 world tour does show you quite a lot of, you know, the world. I also do, like, whole backgrounds of, you know, different stuff in the world. Like, I did a uh, one for, a uh, when I first hit 1,000 days in the series. How many days have we hit? 1,501. That's how many days we have been in this world. 
doesn't seem like much, you know, compared to like the people who play hardcore, but I have recorded most of every single day that it's been passed in this world. And then we did get set back like 500 days, so we're probably at 2,000 days. I got set back 500 days because of my world corruption. So that, that was quite annoying when that happened. Uh, I always like, you know, looking back at all the bad events in this uh, world. And, you know, thinking, we can learn, you know, something from this. And also, I might actually fix up this wall. I feel like I could make it go out more. Yeah, I feel like I could go out more. Yeah. I think that would be a nice idea of it going out more. Uh, do I want to work on this now? I could do like, you know, a quick mining job of it. There we go, and also that light now needs to be picked up. Placed on the ground immediately so no mobs spawn around here. Well, maybe one mob will spawn around here due to how, you know, the darkness and light is around here than now. But I think that is a lot better. Yeah, that'd be, that'd be a lot nicer there. Okay. So, break all of that there. And break all of that. Yeah. Yeah, that should work. And then put all of that in there. That's 23 coal blocks there. Coal ore blocks. Okay. Well, we're gonna go head back, grab some of the resources to do the wall in around here. I could have just head through the other way, it would have been shorter. Well, I guess we never, you know, really take this way too much, so might as well take it. Also, I need to do up that fence and might take some of the fences that we already have and put them along there while we're coming back here at the end of the episode. Eat some big potatoes. There we go. And let's continue on. Let's head up here. Now, so this was another place I needed to do up the walls, and I shall do that another time. Just checking there. I was wondering what that was there. I can hear my chocobos, and I can hear the pigmen that I have in a boat. Uh, I can put the uh, rails in there for now. Just temporarily. Hmm. Yeah, grab one of I will put that in my other backpack. You're probably wondering why I'm keeping this on me. Just in case I need it. Now. Now, let's see. What was it that I needed? Ah, yes, I remember now. I needed blue terracotta. Yeah, that should do. I guess we get to see uh, the underground bit of this now. Also, if you're wondering what this area is, this is where we just did the... Let me teleport backwards. The Underground Dam, also known as the uh, Transo Stone Water Stream Crossing. I gave it a new name after we did a lot of work on it. I need to lay up that spot down there, it seems. But I do quite enjoy what we did here. It does look a lot nicer than... Uh, previous stuff that we've done. Uh, let's see. You know what, I'm just looking so forward to doing the world tour soon. But also I want to try and get as much done before that, so there's a lot more stuff for you to look at in the world tour. You know what, I should do a world download. Maybe I should do that at some point. I do have a uh, Saves that go back to episode 7. 
Yes, that far back. I've had backups. Uh. Right. I've realized that uh, we do not have any andesite. Pretty sure I may have some ande- yeah. I do have some andesite in this shulker box. I have quite a lot of andesite. Put that in there. There we go. That works out. That works out pretty good. Okay, that is working. Yeah, that's not too bad. Oh, so sorry. I was just thinking about something there. That being a Medal of Honor game. Now, I was talking about doing, like, games earlier. For, uh, Random Games, Random Days. Well, a Random Games, Random Days series. Uh, we'll see. As I have started to separate Random Games and Random Days into, you know, like, you know, if it's like a single episode or a couple of episodes that stays in the random games, random days playlist. If it's not, it turns into a playlist series called a random games, random days series. I know, it's very weird. It's just so it was able, because, okay, here's how it went. So, the playlist of Jungle Paradise Golden Age is 600 and something, 60 or something. Now, the Random Games Random Days playlist is 700 episodes of different stuff, right? And I thought, you know, who's got to go scrolling through all of that? So, I thought, you know what, after so long, I will finally change Random Games Random Days to have series. Like, you know, real proper playlist series. So that's what happened, and that's what we did. That's why Bioshock 2 is a Random Game Tram Days series. But it's not in the Random Game Tram Days playlist. Just a little bit of stuff that I wanted to talk about. Hmm. You know what? I'll just keep it up there. One. Yeah, yeah. That should work. That should work out pretty good there. Finish up this wall over here. Now this has been quite a long build, I would definitely say. My arm is aching from all the block placing I've been doing in the last couple of episodes. There we go. Ah. There you go. Not looking too bad at all. Not looking too bad at all. Uh, let's see. I go like this. Because I want to do, do this the last time that I saw it. But I did not have the blocks yet. Uh, let's see. That also makes this look a little bit nicer. You probably won't actually see that bit there. In there. When you're going up the stairs, I don't think so. Too well. As I, I do want to do the blue terracotta up here. Either that, I'll probably leave it like that for a little while longer. Also, I think I might have had torches on these stairs and I might have broken them, so they're a little bit dark. Eh, uh, let's see. But we'll break all of these over here. There we go. That's not looking too bad. Not looking too bad at all. And grab that there. That is quite nice. I do quite enjoy the blue terracotta, it does look quite nice. Uh, let's see.
that is uh, that fossil thing there. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, I was wondering what it was there for a second. Now, I could possibly do a little bit of this wall. have not been able to complete this now. We actually got a lot of it done. Uh, I did not expect to get this much work done. We've got seven in there. Gotta use these torches that have been down here for a little while. And light up these walls a little bit nicer. I do love it when it's right there because it looks so blue. And it actually looks quite nice. move that over to there. Yeah, yeah. That should do. That is not too bad. I didn't, you know, get it full successfully, you know, nice looking, but, you know, we got a lot of it done. There we go. Polished andesite gets in there. Uh, let's see. And then I did actually get a good idea for uh, the lining of this area. You know what? Why does this remind me of Toy Story and... Is it Andy's room? Yeah, Andy's room. I don't know why. It just gives me that vibe with the blue walls. Uh, let's see. But I did think of an idea and that was copying this bit over here and making it go all the way along the wall. Kind of look... Kind of... Kind of like what we did uh, with the lush caves down here. I remember trying to decide on, do I place it down like that? Or, you know, make it go along the wall. There's some that go on the floor, there's some that goes on the wall. I really need to fix all of that. Uh, okay. Well, let's get back to that build. Uh, I think that's all it's done with the andesite. No, we still have a little bit more over here to do. There we go. That's not too bad. I hear a bird. Somewhere in the game. Uh, let's see. I think that would be a nice area for an office. Not so. There we go. There we go. Also. Gather sand. Just to remind myself at the end of this episode. But I do think that starts. Oh, oh, poop. I got about the slurring over here. We'll finish off this slurring and then that to be us done for today. There we go. We'll probably remove the original slurring over here. But I will take inspiration from that. There we go. That's not looking too bad. Place a torch there. Break the last of this over here. And... This is going to look quite nice. Give me some of that. There we go. Time to fill in all of this now. Looks quite weird with that bit being there, but you know, good to do for now. Out of that, I probably I have another idea. With this, we could put like jungle wood there and end that. 
Just a crazy idea there. Do not speak about what I'm about to do. Oh, you will not remember what I have done. Oh, your memory is gone from me placing the slabs. Now you do not remember. Uh, okay. Well, I'm going to shove that back in the backpack. Do I have... Yes, I do have the andesite there. Put that back in the backpack. And, yeah. That should be us done for today's episode. We got a lot of work done for the last two episodes. Getting the walls almost done. Getting the flooring done. It's actually turned out pretty nice. Pick a colour. Uh... I like Rainbow Pickle. Might name another one after uh, I retire this one in a long, long time now. From now. Probably Rainbow Pickle 2. Okay. Well, hopefully you've enjoyed this episode. Have a nice day, too. Put a apple. Maybe some more shoes. Sneakers, vitamins. Very important. And bye. See you next time. Have a nice day. Bye.